metal itself, um, we wanted to do something that, that didn't weigh a lot. How many people have a problem with saute pans because they're so, they're so big? They hurt your, hurt your wrist, right? Um, my wife feels the same way. She hates, she hates my cookware. I think it looks cool hanging up from my pot rack. But when you, when you take it down, when the pan weighs almost 12 pounds, and then you put four pounds of food on top of that, you've got something that weighs 15 pounds, and it really hurts your wrist when you're trying to saute something. So my goal was to make something that, that was super efficient, but used less materials. So we had to dig around and dig around and dig around. So we finally found a couple different pieces. This is, this is what they call tri-ply. Uh, there's, there's three different applications of alloy, and in combination, it's what I call the super alloy. Um, in the middle, it's got like the most high-tech German stainless steel you could possibly find right now. And this is what I mean about the, about the sports car, right? It is, it, you can saute anything. It's got even heat distribution from one end to the other. And I'll show you this once we start to saute stuff. Um, the core is aluminum, right? Um, nobody really wants to cook on straight aluminum anymore, and I think it's a really bad idea, especially if you have some older aluminum saute pans. Um, they're starting to link um, uh, aluminum cooking and cooking aluminum to Alzheimer's disease. So it's probably something you might want to think about if you've got some old aluminum pans and all. This has got the stainless steel liner on the inside, so you never have to worry about that. The aluminum core, uh, that being said, the aluminum core is the second best conductor of electricity next to, next to third. It's gold, um, which is really fabulous to cook on, but you know what I mean? <laughs> Price-wise, a little silly. Copper is next. Copper is a fantastic um, electricity conductor, um, but again, a little expensive and also very, very heavy. Aluminum is the third. Um, so this, it's got a solid aluminum core, and on the outside is hard anodized, right? Which is not so much of a layer as it is a protective coating on the outside. And what they do is they take the take the, the two different uh, layers of metal once they get the saute pan, and they, they float this into a bath, um, and they run electricity through. And, and, and the, the aluminum becomes anodized on the outside and hardens, and it's three times harder than stainless steel. 